Before we start the video guys, I would like to give a huge shout out to FM Mobile. They're the number one page if you guys want to get uh, custom kits, custom badges uh, for your Football Manager Mobile 2019 game as well as other previous editions. So check their page out, they have other useful mods you can implement in your game as well. Welcome back to a new video guys. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the FM Mobile 19 logos for the competitions and leagues and clubs. So uh, this game dropped on November the 3rd. I hope you guys have had some couple weeks now, about two weeks, to delve into the game and uh, see how it has changed compared to Football Manager 19, and uh, sorry, 18. And uh, leave your comments down below if you find this game a bit more challenging or a bit, a bit more easier, because I'm an active player myself and I want to see, want to hear the opinion of uh, you guys as well. So uh, this game, as good as it may be, it does have trouble with licensing. So as you guys know, it doesn't have licensing for competitions such, such as the Champions League, Europa League and also uh, leagues itself, uh, such as uh, the Premier League and uh, other highly respected leagues. Also, the clubs, a lot of clubs don't have a logo, so it just takes away a bit from the authenticity of the game. But there is a way to go around this. So if you guys click on your Google Chrome browser, type in FM Mobile as it is typed on my search bar up above. Or at this point in the video, just click on the description. I will provide links if you guys, uh, just to make it easier for you guys. So once you're on this page, this is the main page. I have not clicked on anything else. You want to scroll down until you find the, uh, there we go fm19 mobile standard logo packs so click on that should take you to the download page now um uh, just to warn you guys though if you do want to get the mega pack which contains uh way more club logos and stuff it will cost you because you will need to sign up for the fan club members but do not worry if you guys don't want to do that you can get the light logo pack uh, which contains still a lot of uh, clubs uh, 656 clubs 64 competitions and 240 nations so yeah so at this point you guys press download or whatever button you have that appears on the light pack it will take you to sign sign up for the website don't worry you just sign up with your twitter um facebook or google uh google mail sorry once you guys are signed in the file size is 36 megabytes you guys need to click download and this is a zip file guys, so make sure you unzip it with a program or if your Android system automatically does it for you, that's even better. But for me, I've already done this and my uh, Android system automatically unzips the file for me. So I'm not going to download, download it again, but you guys should have it download. And once you guys have it download, just go on your My Files, go into your internal storage, go into your Android. No, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Back up, back up. So once you're here, go to... Uh, go to your my files internal storage then go to download once you're on download you should see your standard logo pack as it is for me here so you need to click on it make sure it's the unzipped version you don't want to copy the zip version i'm not sure i'm not even sure if that's possible but make sure you click on the unzipped version logo pack light pictures and then you're going to need to highlight logos and then press copy once that is done this is the layout for the samsung s8 plus uh, android system so it might be a bit different for you when you copy uh, files but this is uh, it should be the same regardless so you guys need to copy copy it to your internal storage find the android file then go on data and then scroll all the way down uh, make sure you find this file over here make sure you find foot manager mobile 19 folder it might be at the bottom it might be higher up it might be in the middle for you guys so just be patient and look for it once you're on that uh, file click on files click on installed scroll down click on graphics Click on pictures and then logos right here. What you guys are gonna just need to press done, paste it. I've already done it, so I'm not gonna do it again. And um, yeah, once that is done, guys, you are good to go. Once you're gonna need to do next is you're gonna need to go on the foot manager game, and I'm gonna just pros I'm gonna cut into the next slide and show you guys some gameplay of how to do it. Okay guys, so once you're in the game, before loading up or starting your new game, you guys are going to need to go on your settings. Once you're on your settings, you're going to need to go on user interface and then go all the way at the bottom and press reload skin. Press that, it will take uh, maybe a minute and then you should be good to go. You back out, you go into load game, load your preferred file or create a new game and... Um, Just wait for it to quickly load. Okay. 
Okay, here we go, guys. So uh, let's go on to the continental competitions. Here we got the Champions League logo, uh, Europa League. Um, here we go, international. We got the FIFA World Cup, the UEFA Nations League, and others. Here we go, Premier League. We've got uh, the league logo, and here we go, Cardiff, Liverpool. Everyone has the updated logos. Same with Spain, La Liga logo right there. And yeah, that's about it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. There is other mods you can put onto this game like license fixes so as you can see from my game it tells you i have the euro for champions league it has the official name up above and as, as well as for the fifa club world cup and all the other leagues so if you guys want a tutorial on that maybe uh if you guys don't know how to do it then leave a comment and a like down below and i will surely jump onto it until next time guys peace